Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to add card to Google Wallet. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest offer just under this video. So let's get started. Now in this case, how do we add a card into Google Wallet? In this case, first things first that you need to do here is you need to install the Wallet app. Now in this case, once you've installed it, what you need to do is you need to open up the Wallet app. Now, by the way, if this is the first time that you're using your wallet app here, it might ask you to use or choose an email address they want to use for your wallet app. So especially this will appear if you have multiple email addresses. But once you've chosen that, you should be able to see the same UI that I'm currently viewing. In this case, for you to add a card, just click on Add to Wallet at the bottom right of your screen. And from here, it's going to ask you what type of card or wallet or whatever you want to add into a wallet. So in this case, you have multiple options here like Payment Card, Transport Pass, Loyalty, Gift Card, or Photo. So if, for example, you just want to basically take a photo of your QR code or barcode of the pass that you're using, you could just basically take a photo of that. In this case, payment card is whether it's going to be by default going to be like your cards, like credit card, debit cards, if you have those, or if that specific uh, wallet is actually approved by uh, or was or has the technology to accept a Google Pay as a uh, means of payment, then you'll be able to add that card via the payment card here. Transport Plus from the name itself is going to be Transport Plus, like for example, Go Cards in Australia or any transfer pass that you have or is available to own uh, Google Wallet. Now we also have loyalty cards here. So this is uh, going to be your serve or not every loyalty card is supported here. You might need to ask support for assistance on this one. But in this case, you also have the capabilities of adding gift cards if you have those like Amazon gift cards or any other gift cards that is supported by Google Wallet. In this case, we want to maybe use the payment card option. Let's go ahead and click on it. Now, in this case, it's going to say add a payment card. Now, in this case, if you've chosen or, if, for example, you've already used a card before on your Google account, it's going to suggest you to enter or basically add that into your wallet as well. But in this case, if you want to add a new one, you can just basically click on the new credit or debit card option. And from here, it will redirect you to another page, which is going to be a secure page and you won't be able to actually see it on my screen. But in the screen, you need to enter the card number that you have on your card, the expiration date, as well as the CVC or CVV at the back of your card. Now, once you've entered those details, it should redirect you to another page where in this case, it's going to give you the terms and conditions and policies for your bank. Now, I do have to note to you that the policies or the agreement that you'll be seeing on the next screen may, might be different for every card. Like for example, if you're using two cards here, the agreement for that is going to be different. But in this case, just go ahead and read that. And at the very bottom, just click on agree. Now, you might also need to further verify yourself, like for example, entering or receiving a OTP. And once you've received that, you can just go ahead and enter it in the app itself. And you should be able to have your cards connected now in Google Wallet. Now, once you've done that, you should now be ready to start using it on your transactions. And that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.